The actual construction of the lighthouse was 1872 and 1873. And again, it's, it's a continuing uh, aid to navigation and operating lighthouse, which makes the whole story of the lighthouse uh, a little more intriguing. About four years ago, I think it was 2014, um, we uh, were able to get the lighthouse from the state, from DCNR. We have a 35-year lease. Uh, and we established a nonprofit that allows us to go after, grant, go after grants and funding to again to start to restore rehab and uh, preserve the lighthouse. Uh, the state was ready to, I guess, to get out of the lighthouse business. And as they say, all the stars, all the moons were lined up and it was the perfect time to uh, open the lighthouse, if you will, back up to the public. It had really been shut down since 1872 as there was light keepers in here, Coasty, Coast Guard uh, personnel in here and park personnel in here uh, up till uh, about 2014. So that's, uh, it just lined up that, that that was the year it came together uh, with our nonprofit to establish a nonprofit with the state and uh, where we were able to, if you will, take over the lighthouse and, and, and start the restoration and open it up to the public. The short answer for the mission of the, of the lighthouse is the preservation and the restoration of the Presque Isle Lighthouse and the education of our visitors of the uh, great maritime history we have here on Lake Erie in the peninsula. And last year, in 2017, we had uh, a little under 17,000 visitors climb to the top of the tower. Uh, was a very successful season for that. We had another 25 or 30,000 visit the lighthouse in the grounds. But we say easily there was a total of about 40,000 40, uh, plus visitors that came here uh, to see us here at the lighthouse. I think one of the most fascinating things about the lighthouse that people, or a lot of people are not aware of, is it's still an operating lighthouse, or as we say in the parlance, an, an aid to navigation. Um, and I think that makes it very special for me because it's not, we're not re just rehabbing um, or restoring an older home. So it really, is, uh, it really is a maritime piece of history that we have right here at the park. And um, again, that makes it a little more special to all the visitors and, and to myself included. Um, we have a number of different ways you can support the lighthouse. One is to volunteer here at the lighthouse. Um, other ways to support the lighthouse are, of course, to, to become a member of the lighthouse organization and donate to the lighthouse. Our membership is expanding, and uh, we ask everyone to, you know, if you can, please become a member of the lighthouse. You can always do that online on our website at www.prescalighthouse.org.